Sista, welcome to another reaction review video with me, Nina Schofield, singer, songwriter, vocal coach, and session musician, and big Morissette fan. And today we're going to be watching another duet of hers. This is on the Wish Bus. Back to the Wish Bus. I love me the Wish Bus. And this is Arnel Pineda. I'm, I'm saying his name right, I think. And Morissette covering I Finally Found Someone. So this is going to be hopefully very good. I love my duets, especially when both vocals are amazing. So together, fingers crossed this will be good. Obviously I'm new to Arnel, so that will be the, the clincher with this one. Are you ready to watch with me? Here we go. Hi there, Hi. wishers. I am Arnel Pineda. And I am Morissette. For more, more fish videos, click here to subscribe. <laughs> uh, well, at least they're comfortable, you know, we can have a relaxed performance. Now, will it be just piano backing? Wait, is, is Arnold playing? Wish 1075. No. no. Ooh. Makes me think of Brian Adams or something. That kind of rocky tone. Makes me feel complete. Oh, a little bit of unison. I feel like this performance was one that are they really good friends because I feel like they're good friends and they just kind of got together and jammed this out a few times and they just thought yeah let's go on the wish bus is the grittiness of his vocal against the purity of Morissette's. They, their vocals really do go together. They really do. Hmm. This is it. Oh, There's a, that little cry. Keyboardist looks chill. <laughs> See there, you get the the instant vibrato because you can have the technique of holding the note and then letting the vibrato come or you can go straight in with it both are great it's just here that's what Morissette's doing and then Arnel I feel like is more of a straight singer a straight shooter <laughs> to be with every night cause whatever I do it's just got to be such a unique tone he does a lot of that, uh, like the kind of almost tense jaw, I would say, singing. But I think that's his his thing, maybe that kind of uh, rocky uh, approach. It's just bigger, I finally Nice. We'll listen to that again. having the conversation vocals but because they have to look at the lyrics they can't look at each other so it gives it a totally different vibe if they were on a stage and they knew the lyrics and were looking at each other and singing this back and forth it would be so different so I almost am gonna not look at the screen for a sec just to see how that feels Oh, I finally found someone. The 
二期的。See now they're looking at each other a bit, so maybe they know this part of the song more, which I like. I love that communication. I think it's so important as well to get the best out of your performance, and it's a duet. You've got to kind of have that vibe with each other. But the distinction with their harmonies is great. So, you know, when you're doing harmonies, the the main thing that people find difficult when they start to learn harmonies is singing their bit without being distracted by the other person's bit. So they've got that down, you know, the more you do it, obviously the easier it becomes with practice, but there's just such a great distinction, probably because of their tones as well, but the harmonies just sound woof. It's got to be you, oh, my life has just begun, I finally found someone. Dynamic Interesting there, we can hear a little bit more of Arnell's vibrato because he was doing more of the rock edge. We'll just let this play out and then <laughs> I think they had a good time. Lovely. Yeah, they're friends, aren't they? <laughs> They are definitely friends. Uh, yeah, but because Arnel's vocal was more like, oh, oh, it's that rock edge ending that he goes for stylistically. So it was really interesting to hear him just hold that note right at the very end there. I was kind of hoping that he would because, you know, whenever you hear a, a singer with a rockier tone and stuff and they do just kind of go for the short ends of their phrases, it makes you wonder. But if you just held it on for a second, what would it be like? So we got a, a little whisper of it. Um, obviously, when you've got Morissette's strong vibrato on top, it's harder to hear. But I think their voices, as I said, really go together really nicely. And because they're friends, that more chilled out kind of jam it vibe was present in that performance for me. Um, and as I say, if they got on stage and did it in a totally different setting, we'd probably really feel a completely different atmosphere. And, uh, but yeah, it was it was good. It was fun to watch and a really good introduction to Arnel's vocal for me. But the question is, what other duets should I be watching? You gotta let me know. Let me know in the comments box down below. And if you enjoyed this video, please do hit that subscribe button, turn on the notifications, become part of our family here if you haven't already. And you can of course find me on Twitter and Instagram at Nina underscore Schofield. And you can find links to my own music. I have a new single out called Not Perfect Now. I'd love for you to see the music video. Alongside links to my Wizio page where I can help you out with your singing and answer any questions you might have for me. And links to my Spotify playlist, Healing Hits and my merchandise. And that's all in the description box down below. And I will see you guys very soon for another video. Love ya. Bye.